Hello friends, welcome. So in the previous video we worked with uh, countries and now we have a grad for country. We display all the countries in this nice table and we can create and also delete and edit the country. Now let's go and work with the others. So I'm going to create a state resource, city, department and employee. So in the filament PHP, we can create the resource by saying PHP artisan make colon filament dash resource and the name, as you can see here. Let's open the VS code or here in the terminal, I'm going to create all of the resources we need. So PHP artisan make filament dash resource and first I'm going to create the state resource okay next the city resource okay the department and now the employee resource okay very good Let's go in the project, refresh, and here we have, we have cities, countries, departments, employees, and state. Very good. Now we need to work because right now we don't uh, have forms and also tables. So let's start with state first. Let's open the VS code. And here we have a country resource. I'm going to open the state resource and let's copy what we have in here paste in the state resource now for the state what we need so let's go back in the employees for the state we need the country id and the name so we need text input name. Okay, we need to import the text input. And we need to import also the import the card from filament forms components card. Okay. And we need the country ID. Now for the country ID, we need to say belong. Uh, select sorry select so let's go in the filament and go to the form builder and down there we have this select field and here we have select make author but we need the re make relationship so here we have select make author id and relationship so i'm going to copy that Come here and instead of the country code, let's paste that code in, import the select here and say instead of author ID, we need to say country ID. Okay. And also the relationship is country. And we need the name. Very good. Save. Go to the browser. And refresh. Go to the state, new state, state country. Okay, make relationship country. Let's open now the state model. Oh, okay, why we don't have, I, I think I forget to add relationship in the state and also I don't have add the protected fillable, so let's do that now. The last sign fillable, which is going to be an array with country ID and the name. And now let's create the function for the country. And return here 
dollar sign this belong to the country country class very good now also let's create the function for the employees and return dollar sign this has many employee class save it and close now let's go back refresh and yeah here we have the country we can change uh, choose the country and let's go to the country and here when we have america let's say united states save okay go to the state create new state select the state and let's say london create and now we have create let's say manchester save and let's go to the states and work now with the table and if i come here now for the state we need a list of states with search and we are going to search for the name and the create update and delete okay so let's go in the code and i'm going to copy what we have here and paste in the state resources table here inside this table let's paste that in we need the id import the text column we need the id we need the name create that and now if we need the country here so let's uh, go to the table builder display data from relationship and we can say text column make the author name instead of this we say text column make not author name but uh, let's remove this searchable and you know what uh, let's make here the name first the name and after i'm going to say country name country dot name the same we have here so this is the relationship method and the name from the relationship method and i want to make sortable and that's it save go to the browser refresh and here we are we have the id the name the country name and the created ad and let's create new state again from the united states and i'm going to say new york create go to the states and if i search for new york okay works search for manchester works and of course if i sort by country work good now let's work with the city the same thing so i'm going to close the country now and let's copy what we have here in the state resource and paste it in the city resource here in the form paste that in change the country to be state the relationship is state and we need the name from the state we need to import the card filament forms components card we need to import the select and also the text input very good now let's go and work with table let's copy what we have here paste in the city p 
because it's going to be almost the same. So import the text column. And we need the ID, the name. Now instead of country name, we need to say state name, save, go to the city. We don't have any city yet. Create new city, select Manchester, and I'm going to create a Manchester. City. Create, very good. Create new one. Here we have, let's create new one. Select New York and also New York. Very good, go to the cities. We have the ID of the city, we have the name of the city, we have the name of the state, which is the relation and the created dot. If I search for Manchester, very good. Let's search for New York. Okay. Everything works. Let's go and work with a department. And for the department, we need only the name. So let's copy this uh, card from here and open the department resource, paste that in and import the card. Let's mean that like this, import the card, import the select. Oh, we don't need the select here. We need only the name. So let's remove that. Import the text input for the name. And let's go back, copy what we have in the table, paste it here. And we need to remove the state name because we need only the ID name and the created at. So import the text column, save, go to the departments and we don't have any departments yet. So let's create new name, Laravel department, create and create another Vue.js, create and create another. And let's say react, react.js. Go to the departments and here we have the ID, the name and create a dot. And also if I see here now the city is the same list of cities with search, department list of departments with search. Very good. And create, update and delete. So if I say Laravel, yeah, very good. And if I go and edit Laravel, we can edit. So to show you, here it is, we can delete that. Here we have an delete department. Yeah. Okay, friends, uh, that's it about this video. In the next video, I'm going to work with employees and also we need to work with uh, the have a crowd for the user. You can see here we have user management, create, update and delete, change the password and search user by username and email. So see you in the next video and don't forget if you like a content like this, subscribe to my channel and see you in the next one. All the best.